Let's take a look at sub gigahertz messaging on the Flipper Zero. So I've got two Flipper Zeros here. We want to communicate with each other using messaging via sub gigahertz. Let's do it. All right, so the first thing I want to do is go into apps, then sub gigahertz, and enhanced sub gigahertz chat. Now we have some options here. Let's go through the first one. The first one is no encryption. 433, so you could switch this to just about any frequency you want that the Flipper Zero can deal with. For this test, we'll just go with the ones that are in there already. As you can see, maybe. They're both the same. Save. Save. Let's type a message. And right here it says, this Flipper Zero said hello. Hello from here to here. Well, let's answer back. Let's answer back right here. And there's my reply. So we hit the back button to reply again. Let's just say, pancakes. Pancakes. We have a pancakes. So that's a cool way to communicate. Let's take a look at a couple of the other things. A couple of the other ways. Let's use a hex key. Our hex key will be ten with all zeros. Oops. Let's try that again. Let's join that channel. Hex key. Let's see if we did this right. Oh. Looks like we did. Cool. Sub gigahertz messaging. Let's take a look at a different one. Password. The password shall be Q 
W E R T Y. All right. Oh, gosh, I can remember that Q. W E R T Y. All right, let's see. see we did we did and we did sub gigahertz messaging again See what this does. Generate. Let's see what generate does. See if we get the same generate. So low. Oh no, it says over here decryption failed. That's one to play with a little bit more, I suppose. But the rest of them work just fine. Let's try again one more time here. No encryption. Q W E R T Y. Bam. A S D F. Bam. That's cool. Sub gigahertz communication. If you want to communicate just a little bit better than um, like uh, smoke signals, then uh, this is where you want to go. It's pretty cool.